So uh, I'm just I'm just getting to my landmark, my drop. And I'm, I'm just working off the quarterback eyes. That's what you do in the zone. Working off his eyes and I see there is open man and uh, I tried to get there as fast as I can so I could cover it up. And thankfully he threw it, so. Did you think you were getting all the way to the end zone? That was the plan. I didn't want to go down at all. Reminded me of my high school days when I used to carry the ball a little bit. <laughs> How tired were you at the end of the run there? Can you see the goal line? I wasn't tired after the end of the run, but after the celebration, all the slaps on the head and stuff, everybody hugging you and stuff, <laughs> that, that's pretty tiring, honestly. But I had to catch my breath, get ready for the next series, so. Getting back in the, you know, a few takeaways for you guys tonight. How big was that, you know, after a few games mm -hmm. without getting one? You know, that's that's always our game plan in, in uh in, in on Monday meetings. Come in, uh <clears throat> come in, talk about getting takeaways, getting getting the ball back to the offense. That's that's our job and as a defense, you know, you know, turnovers come in bunches, so that that was our plan and we we uh we missed a couple actually and then we gained a couple too, so it all cancels out, so that's all yeah. How big the offense tonight at one point scored mm -hmm. on six straight possessions. Yeah. I was scoring 26 minutes in the second quarter. I know you guys aren't going to be established, but how much yeah. does that energize you when you see the offense going out there and building on the lead and giving yeah. you guys a cushion? Uh, we, you know, that, that's always the that's always the plan yeah. to get the ball to the offense and uh, having them just going down there and score. But there was a couple of drives when we had we was out there too long. They we let them score a couple of touchdowns and uh, we we just uh, we talked to this defense. We said we owe the offense some. We all offered some uh, some turnover on down, so we had to uh, do our best to get the ball back to the O, to get it back like three and out, short series, make sure that they still on the field, they they keeping a uh, they keeping a row going. So yeah. after what? Go ahead. I was gonna say how important has it been, Cash, to kind of make teams one dimensional to start this season? Mm -hmm. So at first we was preparing for the running quarterback, so we was depending on a lot of RPO stuff. And then we seen we seen that they changed the quarterback. We, you know, we talked about it on the sideline, talking about uh, <clears throat> that he he wasn't really going to pull the ball in his own read, so more run and more pass. So, yeah. How big was it to come back today after the disappointment in Tulsa? I mean, we played with a chip on, on our shoulder every week, but <clears throat> just that feeling we talked about it with Coach Cali is that feeling with uh, just putting on your shoulder pads and I mean taking off your shoulder pads, taking off your cleats is. After a loss, it's just hard. Like we should have won that game. This and that. It's it's all said and done. So we have to move on and prepare for this one. I feel like that this bye is coming at a particularly good time, considering all the injuries you guys are dealing with. Yeah, I, I think everybody can get in the training room. Yeah. Whether they played a lot, played a little bit, get in the training room, get right, get ready for uh, San Diego State.